Welcome to my YouTube channel. For those who are new here, my name is Nulu Tando Kumalo, now known as Uande. And for the returning subbies, I appreciate all the love and all the support that you guys continuously show me. Today, I thought I should document what Ande's morning looks like. This is not a full reflection of the morning, but I thought it's something so enjoy. I stepped into a room, told everyone to be quiet Cause I had something to say, blew everybody away Wear whatever I want Dressed in a gown, everybody's like Why are you going nowhere special? Just going to the store, I think I'd have it all taken On this particular morning, I found myself having to wash Impasa Zamzai Zolo Because this is not a seal, I can't move my foot so that's what i'm doing now before i actually get busy with today's festivities which is ilanch katsiki where people come by people i mean family the family comes to eat and we celebrate utsiki kanulu nembele kukazani so yes once i'm done doing this i'll basically get dressed or get ready for the day and go to the kitchen apo makuti bachila koni habitat yu makuti kele Problems disappear. She could tell you the things you want to hear. She could read your mind and that she could believe all the little lies to tell yourself a lie. Never get it wrong, it's always right. Making the play, being the play. She is on a roll. Never seen it like this. Didn't think it exists and no truth. I need you 
First things first, when I get to the kitchen, I have to make sure that the elderly people's water is ready for them to bath. So I actually mix the cold and warm water in a 20 liter bucket and I take it to them. After that, I make sure that I mix milk and water, allow it to boil and make sure that that's ready and boiling on the stove so that once they're done bathing, I can save them breakfast. Breakfast on this day entails steam bread ulusu which is tribe and tea or coffee As the day progressed, I got carried away and didn't document us preparing lunch and serving lunch. I actually think that I got overwhelmed by the things that were required of Huande. But I quickly remembered that a girl's got to do what a girl's got to do and started vlogging again. <laughs>
Before I knew it, it was the end of the day and my sister in love offered to give me a foot massage, which I needed, by the way. I actually don't know how I would have survived without her. She made my life so seamless and easy. She made sure that I am taken care of. She made sure that I am loved. She made sure that I feel welcome and that I feel like a sister that I am. And because of that, I relaxed because of that I actually wanted to stay longer and I actually want to tell her that I love her so much I pray that God provides for me to be able to provide for her I pray that God blesses her beyond measure that God unlocks doors that she hopes and prays for I pray that God fulfills her heart's desires and make sure that she knows how much she's loved till my next vlog i hope that you guys enjoyed bye